Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of the Guild Wars 1 Let's Play. We are here in Ilona still. Last episode we saved Cost of the Boss from Corn and Cap Shorter. And now, we are off to rescue some Sun Spears. A hero shall lead them. We need to evacuate the wounded, but they'll never make it to the coast with everyone in this country against us. However, it seems not all Cornans are happy with Varish. If we can win over more of the populace, they'll make the evacuation that much easier. The local priest may help us with that. But to make this all work, we need a new leader, and I think it should be you. Of course, you'll have to be you'll be able to command the respect of all the Sun Spears. Therefore, you must first achieve the rank of Sun Spear General or be one of the distinguished leaders Cormier herself recruited from foreign lands. When you're ready, Koss will update you on the evacuation plans. All right. Are we a Sun Spear General? We are a Sun Spear Commander. We need 1.5k more points. That's a lot of points. <laughs> the command post. Okay, let's do this. Though we are battered, we are not broken, so long as we have, we have you to lead us. At the back of Sunspear Sanctuary is an area called Command Post. This is where you can meet with your squad to discuss battle tactics and strategies. It also links to underground passages to other areas of Corno, so we can move around undetected by Varish. Duncoro is waiting in the Command Coast. No doubt he has some plans on how we should proceed. So it looks like we will be building up the Command Post. I thought maybe we'd do this as a side series, or I'd have to do this for fun or whatever. But it looks like I'm going to have to do it just to get enough rep. Uh... Again, I've basically always played this campaign as a foreign hero, so I always forget that this is part of it. Let's, uh, okay, yeah, so we have to do building the base. Building the base prisoners of war. You know what I've said about sticking in the plan? When the situation changes, get a new plan. To stand against Russia's forces, we have to regain our strength, and that means rescuing our Sunspear brothers and sisters scattered throughout the territory. Marashi yeah, scout has discovered a small company of Corning guards escorting a band of captured Sunspears. So here's the plan. We ambu ambush those guards before they reach Sunward Marches to rescue our captured brother. And if we wait, they'll be too many to fight as is. We're outnumbered, but we're Sun Spheres. We can handle it. So that's the new plan. Hit them fast and hit them hard. Let's get moving. I love it when a plan comes together. <laughs> I love it when a plan comes together. All right, let's get it going. So yeah, as you uh, build up this base here, you get more and more NPCs in the base to do stuff. Kind of cool. All right, where are we going? We're going up this way. Let's talk to this wandering priest. <laughs> That's the same uh, dialogue that we've heard before. <laughs> Oh. Our, yeah, it's a beast reward. I need to increase the attack speed skill. Whatever, I'll add that to the list of stuff I should do. Nope. Alright, so let's keep on going. Give your feet a rest. A captain needs a moment in the shade. Let's see if we can sneak up on these Cornans before they get uh, too much wiser. Let's take out these. Look alive or under attack. It looks like they haven't aggroed their friends yet, though, thankfully. I was talking about in a previous episode, I think I am going to end up doing the, uh, the Turai episode again to get a shield. Because so I was thinking, oh, we could get a cool different shield for, like, each zone we go in. That would be awesome. And then I realized that most of the, like, actual interesting shields in this game would require me opening chests for hours and hours just to get a different skin and pray it's the right attribute. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to get an easy one. Alright, rescued us some Sun Spears. That was easy. 
We're going to do a couple of these quests. Thank God, I thought the only means to freedom would be the chopping block. Well done freeing those sun spears. You did especially well. Keep flexibility in mind next time you assault a large group. Remember the value of patience to Dunkoros? Says a little patience goes a long way. Our rescued brethren and new allies will help us resupply behind enemy lines. That means I can make sure you can be rewarded for the risks you took today. Those sun spears you rescued is set up a shop in the Kormir and the command post. You can check with them anytime. All right. You getting up there? Still need a couple more points, though, so we're going to go out here and pick up some more quests. But the command post has changed, so we will have a look at that actually, as we're going around. But yeah, see, this these are these uh the the people we rescued. So, oh, this is something important. This is a profession changer. I forgot to mention this. So, remember when we became closer to the stars or ascended in the previous campaigns? Um, that let us swap our elite specs and now go or not elite specs. Excuse me, I'm playing Guild Wars 2. Swap our uh, second profession and go to um the. Uh, realm of the gods, that stuff. Well, now we can do that because we stopped, you know, we cleared out this sanctuary. We got that same kind of blessing. Which is a little weird. It's not quite as grandiose as the other ones, but whatever. But yeah. Now we can change our profession, so we can do that here at this girl. <laughs> We also got a skill trainer, hero skills. So these hero skills guys are basically just trainers that can uh, give us, like, essentially skill unlocks for our account um, instead of just for us. So kind of cool. Here's the new skills vendor, some skills. I don't think there's anything here I necessarily want. Ah. I don't think so. I'm looking for... To the limit. That's the shout I want for my build. No, nothing like that. I still have a signal of capture. All right, we're good. But yeah, so as we get more and more people, they'll kind of fill up this uh, hull. So let's talk to uh, I guess Koss again for the next one. Yeah. <laughs> Building the base, the interrogation. I received word that Narashi has captured a court and scout and is holding him on the Marga coast. Right now, we must gather as much intelligence our enemies as possible. What they know about us and what they know about our operations. I need you to interrogate and narrash these captured scout and learn what, you, what any corner knows. Are, are you up for this? Absolutely. A little bit of interrogation. Mark a coast. I think this is a... Uh, yeah, this one you actually go back through the sanctuary to get out to. I hope you all are having a lovely day. It's a little bit warm where we are, where I am today, but... Besides that, it's pretty nice. It's been pretty nice for a little bit. I do need to go pick up that shield at some point. Ooh, I do need to also keep in mind weapons for everybody else. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I need to double check basically every weapon drop I get. Um... It's kind of annoying having to collect all the mods and everything for every character. I know it's like, you know, it's part of the game. It gives you something to work on. But when you have so many characters, the fact that you have to put so much money into gearing up their, uh, your heroes and stuff on each character, it can be a bit annoying, especially if you're like a min-maxer. Um, but even if you don't want a min-max, even if you just want some basic stuff, which is like, you know, I'd like, I'd be nice if these guys had, you know, better, you know, decent weapons. There's some quests here as well. Yeah, a whole bunch of quests here. We're going to keep working on the building the base quest, though. I think that's the direction I want to take for getting my Sun Spear points where I can. Alright, let's go find Narashi. Looks like she's over here. I definitely want to... Build up the old Baseru, especially if I ever decide to pick up the uh, the elite Sun Spear armor. 
I don't think I am. I think we're going for Norn on this character, I believe, is the armor I decide on. I think it looks cool. Either Norn or Abby, I haven't decided. I think the Rit is getting Abby armor. Land you be praised. I'm glad you're here. Whatever is happening in Corna has disturbed several large insect hives across the sun's tree side. Now those creatures are everywhere. Melandra herself will preside, provide you with her blessing for this service. We're here to join the fight to cleanse this land of insects. Sure, no problem. Very pretty, this zone. I actually like this zone. There's the coast over there. You can kind of see it. I love these like rock plateaus things. I guess it's not a plateau. What are those called? Where like the rock is balancing on a single point. I love these trees and like this foliage. And kind of like the almost clay dirt. It's very... Pretty isn't the right word, but it's aesthetically freezing. <laughs> there you are. Just in time, I was afraid I'd be forced to sully my blade in this prisoner's throat. He's been making quite the ruckus. <laughs> we lucked out with this one. Caught him a long ways away from his cuppy, stooping around an overturned wagon, searching for loot. Sadly for him, the only thing he found was the blade of my knife pressed against his throat. I think I've ruffled his feathers enough that he'd be willing to talk. He's been crying and blubbering for the last hour or two. <laughs> I'll tell you anything you want, just whatever you do, please don't hurt me. I'm allergic to pain. Please don't let that woman hurt me. I'll tell you anything I know, just keep her and her dagger away from me. What are you doing out here? My unit received reports that a group of peasants were tending to injured sun spears. We went to investigate, but found the sun spears had all died of their wounds. We arrested the peasants for aiding and abetting the enemy. My company sent me to the garrison to get instructions on what to do with the traitors. Along the way, I saw an overturned wagon and decided to investigate. When I was rummaging, that ruffian of yours jumped me with her knife drawn. She threatened to kill me if I made a peep. How many men were in your unit? We're a small scout patrol, and truly me, there's eight of us. Where's your unit now? They're just north of here, back where I left them holding the prisoners. Why do you want to know? You're not going to kill them, are you? <laughs> have you seen any other sun spheres? That group was the only one I've heard. That most who survived the battles have been captured or found dead. Those still alive are being held in garrisons. The more important ones end up in Bacchus prison. That's all I know. Don't have any more questions. I answer all your questions. Please don't hurt me. All right. You'd better go rescue those captured peasants. Stay alert. That scout may have fed you bait. What do you want me to do with him? Kill him. He's useless to now. Blindfold him. Take out to the wilderness and set him free. By the time he makes it back to his unit, we'll be long gone. Oh, man. Now we get to make an actual decision. Do we want to kill this poor guy? On one hand, he's a we're little evil working for the evil guys. But on the other hand, he's kind of just, like, he's just a dude here. He's not happy to do it, obviously. He's not, you know. I don't know. This is obviously a reference to something. Um, I don't know. I think it'd be scarier if they found out that there are sun spears around that are doing shit. <laughs> that sounds scarier, so let's do that one. Consider it done. May the blood of our enemies be spilled this day. Find the remainder of the scout unit and free the prisoners. I'll take care of this one. No, don't leave me here. That woman, she has murder in her eyes. <laughs> She has murder in her eyes. Uh, she gonna kill me. Look alive, we're under attack. A lot of bowmen. Get old. Old shouty shout up. I still haven't actually hit one and they've all blocked it. Of course they're all bowmen. So they all have whirling defense. So melee attacks are... Annoying as heck to use against them. <laughs> I hate the coordinates. I should have brought stance removal. The problem is, I think most of Paragon's stance removal costs adrenaline, so if I can't build adrenaline to begin with, it's not gonna do me any good. At least I believe most of the Paragon one costs adrenaline. Thank you for freeing us. The guards were discussing new painful ways to kill us before you arrived. We were arrested for helping injured sun spears. We don't know we didn't know they were outlaws. By slaughtering the guards to break us free from our shackles, our saviors have made outlaws of us all. Don't be so quick to thank them. Boy, you could be dead right now. Shut up. I'll I'll throw a spear through your face as well. Lead the corn and peasants to the safety of the Sun Spear Sanctuary. That's weird that they don't have a, like a dialogue mentioning that. But yeah, so 
You gotta bring them back. This is important. You cannot zone back. You have to actually walk back with them. If you zone back, you have to redo everything. So I'm just gonna make my way back. Oh, there's Ron Jock off in the distance. I love the little villages in Corna. A little farmland here. I think there's a quest here with Koss and Milani, but maybe I'm wrong. I don't remember. <laughs> I feel like there is. There's some side quests relating to a lot of your heroes. Um, I might try to look those up and maybe we'll do them at the end of the Let's Play. get a little bit more uh, background info on those who have been with us. Oh, actually, here's a weapons vendor. What do you sell? Winged axe, barrel hammer, machete, bronze daggers. Actually, what do your shields have them? Oh, these are actually pretty good shields. I might uh, I might make me and Kass a shield from this guy. What do your scepters and stuff have on them? Not that great of a stuff. I don't really want to get everyone everything, but I might pick up a shield here for Koss myself. Eh. I don't know. I'll think about it. To be honest, because I'm probably not going to have any command or anything, I might as well just pick up, like... Actually, wait. I'll be leveling tactics, so I should get a tactic shield. Yeah, I think this build actually eventually puts tactics into it. Oh, wait. Ooh. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. Almost walked right in. Okay, see, no low knife reward. This, this place is well hidden. I never knew of its existence. Let's hope that means the military doesn't know about it either. I'm sure it's safer in here than out in the open. Now that we're outlaws, there's no place safe for us. Almost missed some dialogue. Maybe I'll go find a tactic shield somewhere. Maybe I have one on the account somewhere. Yeah, I'll go do that. Oh, this Turai shield is actually a tactic shield. I could use this. I don't really like the way that looks. I'll find another one that I like. Let's talk to Lonai. The information you extracted from the scout is already proven worthwhile. Those rescued peasants have useful skills. One of them is a master of dyes, another is an animal tamer. The last one I'm not so sure about. He's an extremely skilled rune enchanter, but seems reluctant to be here and get involved with our cause. All of those that you have rescued is set up with a tent in the command post. Check with if you have any need of their services. Alright, let's go have a... Let's go have a little look at them. Not really going to do anything, but let's just go have a little look. I believe they're over here, she said. Yeah, by the tent. Yeah, they're over here. There's a weaponsmith down here, too. Let's see what he has. Um, but yeah, so one of them sees a die trader. That dude in the middle was the one talking crud. He's the rune trader. I think they said the other one was an animal tamer. I don't know where they would be. They don't appear to be over here. Let's see what this weaponsmith has. Uh, looks like it's the same thing that the dude outside has. Oh no, these are clean. These have nothing on them. Maybe the other ones are unmoddable, and these ones are moddable. Max, uh, max gear that's moddable. Oh, this guy's here. He sells you elite sun spear armor. I don't think that's the armor I want for this character. But yeah, that's gonna be uh, that's our first look at the command post quests. We're gonna be continuing them in the next episode. I want to thank you for coming out. I hope you have a great day, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.